are live! It is Bar Wrestling coming to you from Los Angeles, California. My name is Loud and Noxious, right alongside Mr. Killer Kevin Condren. Thank you for the introduction, Loud and You deserve it, my man. You, you didn't need it, but you deserve it. That's so sweet. Eli Everfly and Scorpio Sky, two of the best in Southern California, two of the best in the world. Right? We like to get things started hot and heavy here at Bar Wrestling. Scorpio Sky is just the man to do that. That's right, Scorpio Sky, uh, as you heard, a member of SCU, SoCal Uncensored, one of the hottest groups in professional wrestling today. We love SoCal Uncensored here at Bar Wrestling, don't we, Loudon? Yeah, that's why he's got that big S right there on the side of his, of his tights. SCU! SCU! Scorpio Sky, absolutely. I mean, what a year this guy's had. I mean, his career has leveled up. Yeah, Scorpio Sky, uh, he joined the Ring of Honor at the beginning of the year on a full-time contract. Uh, Scorpio Sky has just, I mean, he's talking about a tour de force. Scorpio Sky has really turned it around. Here we go. No. Well, as you can see right there, Scorpio Sky can do it all, man. He can get it done on the mat. He can brawl. He can fly off the top rope. Don't underestimate Eli Everfly, though. Eli Everfly trains longer and harder than just about anybody in Southern California. He lives at the Santino Brothers Dojo. Eli Everfly, sort of, he breaks that mold of that high-flying acrobatic style because he's just got that mean streak. Sure he does. applies that submission Eli hold right there in the middle of the ring. Oh, and he's trying to break his wrist. Eli Everfly will snap that arm if he can. But Scorpio Sky nope. definitely has the weight advantage, well, you know, and now he's in the ropes. It was pretty easy for Sky to just uh, walk right over to those ropes. Yeah, Eli was. Everfly not, not going to win in the body weight department. Well, hey, look, Loudon, you know, Eli Everfly spends all his time at the Santino Brothers Dojo, but you know what dojo Scorpio Sky hangs out at? The New Japan Pro Wrestling Dojo. Scorpio there is a, Sky's a trainer at the New Japan Pro Wrestling Dojo. There is a difference in styles here, but as I like to say, styles make matches. That's why I'm so interested in this contest right here. And we are certainly seeing a styles clash here, yeah, and there's that mean streak. You know, Eli Everfight, like I said, he oh, breaks that, that he breaks that mold. We've already got our first double bird fuck you. You got the counter? You got the counter going? I mean, that's one. You, yeah. click, you got the clicker? Hey, if you guys are watching us on the High Spots Network, you have to take a drink every time. Oh, double stop to the back. <laughs> if you're watching at home, take a drink. Oh, and there's two. There we go. That's your second sip. Here at Bar Wrestling, we like to take a drink. Every time you see a wrestler give the double birds and say, fuck you, you've got to take a drink. That's the new game at Bar Wrestling. You're looking around ringside, lots of people are doing that. Scorpio Sky now with a spinning side slam or perhaps a backbreaker. He's up. He's back down. Breaker. Down hard with that backbreaker. Eli Everfly has been snapped nearly in half. So much momentum behind that simple move like a backbreaker, but when Scorpio Sky delivers it, it's just that much more devastating. You know, Scorpio Sky is like a deluxe action figure, and Eli Everfly is like the bendable ones you can get at the dollar store. Good. Good baby. Eli's kind of like the battery-powered one that can fly around. Get him at the 5 and 10. Scorpio Sky now sizing it up. Picture perfect. Just measured his man! Wow, mean Mark Calloway, eat your heart out! <laughs> right on the side of the ring apron. Yeah, the place where it hurts absolutely the hardest and the most. Trying to break Eli Everfly in half. Scorpio Sky now, he's rallying the patrons of bar wrestling here in downtown Los Angeles. Over the top, maybe? No, he fakes him out. Ooh. Actually, that was a surprising miss from Scorpio Sky. I thought he had him sized up perfectly. The resili it's the resiliency of Eli Everfly. He's right back on his feet. Wow! He's just... Springboard Tornado DDT onto the floor. Just like that insect. When you, you swat him, you think you got him, but he gets right back up and flies away. Good call. Loud and Referee Nick Bonanno told us before this match that there are no more countouts at bar wrestling. That's a rule change for those hey, of you paying attention at home. It's no countouts. Bar room rules, as they say. Bar when you, when you come through those saloon doors, anything goes. Come on. It's bar wrestling here. This is bar this wrestling. This ain't your granddaddy's wrestling. Unless your granddaddy hung out at the bar. He's a heavy drinker. Which my dad, my granddad kind of did. Scorpio Sky now trying to rally the audience. So is Eli Everfly. I mean, frankly, the audience is split on both of these competitors. Eli into the corner. He got a lot of momentum. Andera to the outside. Ooh, and Eli gets a kick right to the head. He just kind of went with that. Oh, as he gets tossed over the top rope. Everfly to the top. Kick up. Roots up. Nope. 
Yeah, that's what oh. Eli's got to do. He caught him. Sky tried to duck it, but he got caught. Eli stays elusive. He's hard to catch. Another flip. And he's slippery. He's oh, slimy. Man. He's slimy. Casadora. And a spinning slice spread he, springboard. He did. Is he going to get him? No. Wow. He got a little bit more momentum off that second rope, and using it as a springboard. You know, Loudon, I don't know if, uh, if you saw this, if the users at home saw this, but Sky was trying to carry him out of that, and Eli used his own momentum to pull Sky down to the mat and slam him. He was one step ahead. He was thinking in that ring, and that's very important when you're in there with someone like Scorpio Sky. Look, it's hard enough to fly around the ring the way Eli Everfly does, but it's even more difficult to fly around the ring two steps ahead of your opponent. Yeah, look at the way he's changing. Springboard slice spread. Hooks the leg here. Oh, and Scorpio Sky kicks out at two. Do you see the way he changes momentum? Like halfway through, he just turns it around, and that's very hard to predict. Eli Everfly is showing that he can absolutely defy gravity. For those of you watching, for the first time, Eli Everfly is in the trunks. Scorpio Sky in the black pants. Eli Everfly now takes his hands, interlaces to the top. Sky! Powers yeah, it down using with a spine that, buster. Using those muscles, that upper body strength to his oh, advantage. Man, there's a big bear crab. Big bear crab from Scorpio Sky. But Eli Everfly, just like I said, he's a bendy action figure. See, they're in the middle of the ring right now, and Eli does not have. Well, he's he's now he's managed to get closer. Oh, he, got it. he doesn't have those long arms he's like Sky does. Now, even though countouts have been outlawed in this uh, building. You can still get the ropes to break a count. And it makes sense here at Bar Wrestling, because look at how the Bar Wrestling crowd is in your face. There's nowhere to go, Kev. No, there's not. And if you go flying out of the ring, you might just get crowd surfed if they like you. If they like you. Scorpio Sky now sizing up the much smaller Eli Everfly. Gets him in a position for a TKO, perhaps. No, Eli out of it. Oh, and there's a spin kick. That was kick. desperation by Eli Everfly, because that would have been it. Eli Everfly signaling that this is the end. No, wait a minute. Scorpio Sky jumping knee, and Eli Everfly just lost a tooth, I think. He connected. And another knee. And again, two times now. Racks him up. TKO. Down SCU. hard. Took the leg. Two, three. He got him. Scorpio Sky is your winner.